What's up everyone, this is Movie and Game Lover 98 and today I'll be doing a video on me demonstrating how to use progressive scan mode with GameCube games. So yep, let's get started and I hope you guys find this video helpful. So yep, what you'll need is a backwards compatible Wii that plays GameCube games and a Wii to HDMI converter well plugged in. And make sure before you do this, make sure you go into the options on your Wii console and set it to ED television or HDTV and make sure it's at 480p. And then you just select the GameCube game that supports progressive scan mode. What I did is I put in Smash Brothers Melee because that's one of my favorite GameCube games as you all know. It's the same way as I'm showing you guys to play GameCube games on the Wii, on a regular Wii. Do the same thing, select that, and it will prompt you with this message. If you want to use progressive scan, and it will say yes or no, I'm going to hit yes. There we go, now it's running a progressive scan. Yep. We're trying it with Melee. Now I'm going to show you guys another game that works very well with Progressive Scan in just a sec. But let me just try it out on the stage really quick and then I'll show off another game. Let me just quickly show it off. Yep, it works really well. So now let me show it off with another game that uses progressive scan and I'll be right back guys. All right, now I set up the next game to try a progressive scan. I put in Mario Kart Double Dash. Let's try that game. And I'll hit yes. Oh, <laughs> didn't mean that could happen. Yep, let me just try going backwards around the course. I'm just going to practice going backwards on the course. Well, anyways, really, yeah, that's how you really run progressive scan mode with GameCube games. What you really need is a backwards compatible Wii that'll play GameCube games. So anyways, yep, if you guys found this video helpful, make sure to give it a good like and make sure to give it a good comment. 
Yep, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video on me demonstrating how to use progressive scan with GameCube games. And hopefully you guys find this video helpful and stick around for another video coming possibly soon.